were done. When I heard your agents would provide a distraction, I did not expect such a roaring fire. The confusion, the running about in circles, it was all very lively. Of course, Lord Enzo and his Venatori were decidedly less lively at the end of it. Except for Norani. Alright, so we got some stuff from that. Colin is finished as well. A report has arrived from the site of the suspected Venatory Enclave. It is non-sequential given accepted historical record. Located Venatory Enclave fires on approach. Assumed they torched their camp while retreating. Not the case. Camp already destroyed. Venatory dead. Dwarven tools found but no dwarves, alive or dead. One deep stalker corpse found. Signs of blight corruption. Best guess Venatory surprised by forces emerging from the camp well. Assume they left the same way. Well collapsed. No passage possible. Enclave scoured for resources for return to Skyhold. On return to Inquisition camp, message found next to a newly opened sinkhole. We always come for our own. What about you, Inquisition? So I believe that's a hint for... Um, whatever people live across the sea. Okay, so we need, we have Josephine is unavailable. Ruffles and Curly and various Kirkwall guardsmen who formerly owed me money. Thanks for digging into this mess for me. I can only think of one dwarf who fits the description of oddly cheerful and also blue-eyed, who'd still be in Kirkwall, and that's worthy. An acquaintance of mine from Hightown. Why he'd do any of this, I have no idea. If you owed me money, forget about it. Merrick. <laughs> um, so we can do Leliana or Cullen. We want a question worthy ourselves, forget the guard, we'll catch him, and Colin would actually just have the city guard do it, but Beric prefers that Leliana do it. Inquisitor. So we're gonna do that. And I need something for Colin again. My friends, I did enjoy our little venture, and I hate to be a bother, but I believe you owe me a favor. After all, Lord Enzo is quite dead. As you may recall, the crows and I are not on the best of terms. They were not pleased I stole their target out from under them. It means they don't get paid. They could have taken credit for my work, but I had already written to their employer. I earned the prize, after all. The crows would like to speak to me. As you can imagine, they've sent more of their number to Hersenia. It's time I left the free marches. So you can send anybody to do it. Um, Josephine would use ambassadors. Leilana would use her agents. Uh, we could send soldiers to sweep Persenia for any remaining Venatorian. If Zevran left with our men, it may go unnoticed. Inquisitor. So doesn't matter. We're gonna use Cullen. I want to go do this one. A pair of elves was found deceased in Empress Dulion, victims of the region's unnatural weather. Evidence found at their camp suggests they had discovered the resting place of the Sulavin blade, a sword from Dalish legend. The blade was lost during the Second Age, and besides being a valuable historical artifact, it's said to be a formidable weapon. The Inquisition's agents should be able to trace the elves' trail back to the blade's location. To see the sword recovered by one of their own and used in service of the Inquisition would no doubt inspire our Dalish allies. So secrets the only option? Why did the elves fail to recover the sword themselves? I want more How information. How is Baron Edward? Cold, I imagine. Why? If the Red Lyrium continues to grow, the cold will be the least of his problems. I want more information on this legend. Okay. Oh no, hold on. Liliana, the Sulavine blade is said to be one of the finest weapons ever crafted. The tale of its loss is rarely shared, but we're all impacted by Corypheus's madness. If the sword may serve the Inquisition, then it serves us all. During the Exalted March on the Dales, a band of elves used the sword to spill innocent blood. They hoped to power magic to use against their enemies. Instead, they were punished for their savagery. Spirits 
reached beyond the veil and struck them down. As for the blade, to this day it lies broken on cursed land. None may touch it without meeting the same fate as those elves. The sword is real, that I know. As for the tale, I cannot say. Stories told to frighten often involve a fair deal of embellishment that doesn't mean something real did not inspire it. Nira, first to keeper, Alindra of Clan Ralafrin. Okay. We will take coal and solace and let's take black wall. Okay. So this is where the Sulavine blade was lost. Lost or misused. There is a reason it was never reclaimed. Um it says there's something, maybe it's up there. So again, another area where we're not gonna get party banter. Beyond party comments. I'm so gonna get lost. Okay, let's go this way. Weed. Be swift and silent. Return it all. Looking for pieces, four pieces of the blade, and then we gotta put them together, I guess. As the sapling bends, so must you. We have the bow. The last one was way of the arrow. Receive the gifts of the hunt with mindfulness, way of the wood. I know I just walked by those. Not explore down here, and there's spiders. Of course, there's spiders. <gasps> fall. Less to worry about. I think if we fall, we can get back up. Okay, this floor definitely collapsed. Where? There's an altar. Be careful. There may be a reason this ground has lain undisturbed for so long. Yeah, we'll see. Requires Bellfire. Okay. Uh, what? I'm gonna make sure. Oh, yeah, there's Bellfire right there. Alright, that's the way down. Let's not... Let's not descend into the darkness. Well, there's a question mark that way. Mm. What happened? Oh. Where did my wheel go? Die! There it is. Yes. Oh, cool. We got it's one only piece. part of the sword. The elves broke it after all. They performed a ritual they did not understand. It appears they paid the consequences for it. That corpse was possessed by a pride demon. I doubt it was alone. There must be more altars. Okay. So we went up that way. We did not go up that way. 
There's more veil fire. And so where does this Okay, alright. We will go down there. But I wanna explore up top first. <laughs> So that I can keep track of what we have and haven't covered. That's not a thing. So we need to go upstairs next. Oh! Sure. Sense. It holds them as they die. But then it's a man and he wants a woman. Why? When they possess people, they often indulge in feelings they have never before experienced. But it changed. It is blank, black, blunted from being. It never wanted before. Have you felt no interest in women since you came through the veil? No. That was party banter. What the heck? <laughs> That was a reference to the film Meet Joe Black. I mean, I'm not complaining that we got party banter. Now I gotta set my timer. I don't even know how long that was. I think there were altars up top, but I wasn't paying attention. I think she would have said something, maybe. More stairs! Ah, <laughs> oh, there's one. So many stairs. Oh no, what? Freaking spiders! Go away! Hmm. Okay, so, alright. Just gotta check these side branches and then downstairs. Oh my goodness. This place is huge. And downstairs? Okay. Masterwork schematic. If you want to get really good stuff, you don't loot everything from the bags and then come back because this place will refill. It'll regenerate. Yeah, I think I anything remember. Anything that's not empty, and this one is gives you loot based on when you showed up, so it'll continue to give you random. Like in the basement, there's certain ones that have uh, diagrams, so it'll give you random diagrams of your level. Okay. I don't I don't know that I'll take advantage of that, but Well, just letting you know. Yeah, no no, no, it's good to know. Thank you. It's actually throughout this whole thing, because we probably picked up some 
Yeah, cause I, yeah, I've picked up plenty of things. But I don't, I don't think I'd want to bother with remembering to come back. <laughs> okay, there was an altar up here. It was down. Okay. Right. Take that. Excuse me. Oh, okay, so those stairs would have just gone down here. Got it. I need you. Ooh, I'll take that. Superb spirit rune. Say peace. But I'll do it. Um, was I in here? No. The same. Okay, more stairs. And the entrance. Take that. Well, I was gonna smack him with my sword and then it didn't matter. I hit the wrong button and it didn't matter. Um, what? Oh, all oh, right, that's good. Let's go downstairs by not jumping. Combat wheel, I guess. Whatever. Okay. Nothing. Probably 
I jump down. This is weird. Just a weird... okay. Huh? Okay, alright, alright, alright. We're in here. You look like the last one. Let's get the loot first. If I can. Dagna can find a way to restore it. Oh, okay. Dagna gets it. All right. Can I just leave? No. No. I gotta figure out how to get to the back to the entrance. <laughs> Ready to answer the great mysteries. It'll be wonderful. I found a sword. We found a sword in an elven ruin. Can you do something with it? That broken thing? You can't stitch a sword. Metal doesn't heal. What if it did, though? That would be amazing. Dagna, the sword? <laughs> Sorry. It's quality, right? I could use the pieces to make a plan for a new sword. One that's less broken. It's like the pieces are... inspiration. That's just perfect for you. Fired the blade, okay. So let's take a look. Not in there, okay. Oh, so is it... Armor penetration, 42 strength, chance to cast Pull of the Abyss on a hit. Dang. So this is crafted for the Inquisitor? No. Iron Bull can use it. And that looks like you need a rune, Bull. Let's put a rune in the thing. Damn it. I used up my rune resources. Okay.
Hmm. Yeah, I'm. We'll we'll hold on to it. I will put it in the storage chest, and I'll come back to it. Oh, someone's done. Liliana, it has been a pleasure, Zevron. You got an amulet. That could be useful. Who do I not have now? I think it's Liliana. No, it's Cullen again. Okay. Alright, he can do this one. A situation is unfolding in the Navarran city of Cumberland, location of the College of Magi, which, until the outbreak of the Mage Rebellion, was the philosophical heart of the Circles of Magi. Now mostly abandoned, it has become the home to a number of mage refugees. This has drawn the ire of local citizens, and mobs are threatening to assault the college and burn it to the ground, with Duke Sandral and Naxus doing nothing to stop them. Inquisition agents suspect that venatory agents are behind the mobs, looking to recover artifacts from the college once its magical defenses are breached. So you can send anybody to do this some people do it a little more gracefully than others josephine of course would use diplomacy um leliana would send in her agents to evacuate the college and cullen would send his the army to occupy the college which doesn't sound like the best route but that's the one we're gonna do inquisitor because it doesn't matter okay um, I think we're gonna head back here and turn some shards in. I think we can open this. Not enough. Okay, never mind then. Never mind. <laughs> 